Today's telecast is presented live from this nation's capital, Marine Washington BS, and we're at Insurrection Field for today's game. The stadium is sold out with the rabbit fans, while the skyboxes are filled with congressmen, lobbyists, and attorneys. Ho oh, ho, our government at work. Pain, suffering, humiliation, and possibly a conga line. This game's gonna have it all. The cardinal sins go up against the Brain Washington Cadavers. Welcome to NFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. Yeah, you think you can go toe-to-toe -to -toe with me? Well, you mistaken, man. You get up in my grill, I'm gonna ruin your world. I'm gonna wreck it. Are you ready for some NFL action? Am I? I love MILFs! Mutants I'd like to fuck! He said MFL, not M-I-L-F, you half-wit. Ow! Oh, I thought you were talking about the Mayhem Bowl halftime milk lingerie girls team! Oh, that zombie QB with that big rack of ribs and almost no waist at all? Ho oh, ho! Va 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 boom! the way a Republican congressman hits the airport. Man, oh, man, he just killed that guy when the play was over. Well, if the ref didn't see it, at least the mortician did. He's coming out in the field now. And it's first and ten. <laughs> that, my friends, was an all-pro NFL hit. Mama, just call him Cap and Crunch. Another one bites the dust. And it's first and ten. He dropped it. If he does that again, they'll drop him. Second down and ten. First and ten. And that's a pick. And now the... And he bursts into the end zone for the score. What a run. Okay. Nice and easy like a two-foot putt. You miss two foot pots all the time, Grim. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. When you get knocked down, you got to get right back up and fight. Uh, what about when you get knocked up? What do you do then? Run. The and he rumbles for big yardage on that play. They're back in business, Bricks. My mom told me to stay out of other people's businesses, Grim. And it's first and ten. Oh, and that's how you play defense. Well, of course, he, he could have had an interception, returned it for a touchdown, and changed the entire game, but I don't want to nitpick. Second down and ten.
Third down, and the punter is warming up. And that's the way you play a guy. Nice coverage. I want Sean Kick to make a kick like this with his extra leg. He used it like a golf club. That wasn't a leg, you moron. That was... He is automatic. Nice kick. Boring. Just get the points. Let's move on. Let's see if they can keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy and uh, or bloodthirsty, whichever. And it's first and ten. And that's an incomplete pass. Looks like the defense got away with that one there. Second down and ten. And he sends him to the ground with an exclamation point. And a well-placed cleat. Third and two. position in football the mighty punter he boomed that one let's see if they can get a return the return if that hit didn't cripple him it certainly left skid marks and it's first and ten First and ten. At this point, with multiple interceptions, the QB should just throw in the towel. Yeah, he'd probably have an intercepted. And he finds open space, is running toward the end zone. Turn on your jets, you son of a bitch. <laughs> ah, that's not fair. Someone should call a penalty on this ref. Yeah, the death penalty. Hang him by the nuts. First down in less than a year. Defense had enough with this rep and jumps off sides to kill him. <laughs> and it's first and ten. I'm running out of here. Ouch! What is this, 80s wrestling? And it's first and ten. First and ten. And that run is good for nine yards. And that'll bring up second and one. I've seen this guy run through a brick wall. He loves pain. First down. 
And it's first and ten. gain on that pass play. Hey, look at the coach. He's picking his nose. You know, they shouldn't put that on the Jumbotron. Seems like every time the camera shows him, he's either spitting, picking, grabbing himself in the privates. Hey. Does the QB know which team he's on? I don't even know why. I'm and that was a bone crusher right there, folks. First and ten. Great run for a nine yard gain. And that'll bring up second and one. comes to an end. Oh, that was a snooze fest. And it's first and ten. I don't know whose eyes the QB is using, but can we get him some new ones? It might not be an eye in team, but this guy's eyeballs are all over the other team's helmets right now. <laughs> oh, man. First and ten. A pickup of about three on that play. Second down and seven. And he was stuck to him like glue. And that'll bring up third down and seven. That's the way to keep the chains moving. That was beautiful. And it's first and ten. And he put on the afterburners after that catch and scored. any mistakes here just kick the ball through the upright for God's sake it goes right through yeah like a double stuff burrito from Taco Hell the home team is feeling confident as they get the kickoff into the air scoring makes anyone confident it certainly does bricks it's so oh, monster hit scratch him off the roster he's a goner the burn returner was maimed by the opposing team, so it's up to the next man to replace him. Yeah, what exactly is a burn returner, Grim? You now, players who catch kickoffs and punts and run them back through the teeth of the defense. They have the lowest survivability rate of any player in the league. The next man up just sat back down on the bench. He probably cramped his pants. And it's first and ten. Picks up the first down. 
The offense is running low on quarterbacks. They have only two left. They might consider running the ball more. And it's first and ten. Oh, now the offense is getting kills. Uh, this is a really violent game, guys. It's fantastic. Second down and nine. And he reels that one in for a first down to keep the drive alive. And it's first and ten. Four yards on that one. And he was just starting to pick up some speed. Hey, Grim, I know a guy if that's what you're after. Second down and six. Oh, that was a hit. You ever had your lights knocked out like that, Bricks? I'll take the salad, Steve. Wait, where am I? And it's first and ten. it in there for a nine-yard completion. They are moving the ball now with authority. And that'll bring up second and one. Man, he shuffled his feet so well on that play. He should go. And that's a hell of a cheap shot. <laughs> Gotta love it. First down in a mile. Oh, and he might have just saved a touchdown on that deflection. Second down and ain't gonna happen, partner. Pow! And how about a little dirt sandwich? Of third down and seven. And the quarterback throws it in. Oh, he just got crushed. Hey, you see that move, baby? No, you didn't. You know what? I'm too fast for you. I'm the greatest. The greatest, I tell you. <laughs> and it's first and ten. Quarterback calls a shot. Oh, oh, oh. That gets me every time. Like a jack in a box, Bricks. You never know when one of those hot potatoes is going to blow. You just crap your pants, Junior. And it's first and ten. And that player has one three. He's the bullet, and the offense is the target. He just put this guy into his misery and says, Who's next? Second down and nine. Oh, like the quarterback said, they blow up the defense today. <laughs> he was right. Third down and nine. Shave a few with the vicious kill. Did you know light hits are one of the leading causes of death for mutants over 25? I didn't know that. Yeah, right below attending bachelor parties and owning a Sam Schwann Galaxy phone. And 
It's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot two. He broke free and has open field in front of him. Oh, the unstoppable force meets the explodable object. First and ten. That's a catch for a one-yard gain. That's not going to do it, fellas. Second down and nine. Just keep pounding the ball right up the... Oh, and you can bury that guy because he is dead. Oh, did you see what number? I gotta check it off my dead mutant bingo card. I only need one more! And it's first and ten. Bricks, it's the two minute warning. You know what that means? Whiskey? And it's first and ten. Tackles. He takes and he held on to that one for a first down. And they take their first time out. Well, how predictable. Surprise us next time. Call the time out there in halftime. And it's first and ten. Bam! Say goodnight to that guy, Bricks. Uh, good night to that guy, Bricks. You're an idiot. And the late hit arrives right on time. When it's your time to go, it's your time. The offense is down to their last running back. No rest for the weary. The last runner has to suck it up and hopefully not die. And it's first and ten. for the first down. And the offense quickly calls their second time out. That's how you do it. Do what? And it's first and ten. And into the end zone with a burst of speed. I think he's warming down his guy to the speed thing, Grim. He's running from his team. Well, this should be an easy chip shot extra point, but you never know with kickers. <laughs> it's good. They need a good return here to set up the offense. He sets up for the return. Let's see if he can break one wide open. First and ten. Oh man, Bricks, you gotta love a player who goes down fighting. Boom to the moon! Another loser bites the dust. In the NFL, winning is really about how much you want it, Bricks. Well, he clearly didn't want to live as much as the other guy. That's a good point, Grim. <laughs> And the offense has only two running backs left, and the defense is licking their lips. Uh, I think they want to hit those last two runners for this out, Grim. And the hurry-up offense wears out the defense since they can't rest their players. Oh, and the quarterback threads the needle for a first down. Oh, come on, that was a cheap shot. <laughs> That's why I love this guy. And so are the fans.
The quarterback shifts gears and goes into his hurry-up offense. And like a monkey trying to fuck a grease football, he gets away in a hurry. Second, and that's it. That's the last time out. It's score or die from here out. And the offense goes into their two-minute drill. Which coincidentally happens to be Brick's match stutzing time. That's what and there's another pick. And th oh, man, he really... Oh, what a great defensive play that was, Brick. Kind of like your Aunt Bertha. This guy has some big balls. What a hit. Yeah, she does have a big pig, Rim. You're right. And it's first and ten. And this guy's like a human cannonball. First, and that's a hell of a cheap shot. <laughs> Gotta love it. And it's first and ten. And that's how you run the football. A pickup of seven on the play. Rim, why is it that more mentally... It's a close battle as the quarter ends. Halftime is brought to you by those caring folks at Monsatan Industries. They make the world a better place by making the government tell you it is. We're at the start of the third quarter in a nail-biter. The teams line up for the second half kickoff. The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. Oh, that's a vicious hit, and the crowd loves it. He just turned that guy into 300 pounds of ground mutiny. And you can't hit a guy much harder than that. And that is unfortunate. He had it for a second there. Second down and ten. Starting to click now. A pickup of eight on the play. Third and two. Oh, man, his neck vertebrae just got crunched. Sounded like a gorilla sitting on a bag of potato chips. And they say at the deli, who's next? Oh, uh, can I get a Swiss on rye with the... Uh... The offense has no running backs left, so this becomes a passing-only offense. Uh, they can still run it with their QB, right, Grim? Sure, they can run their QB into the defense that's feasting on runners. <laughs> Sounds like a good plan, moron. Hey, watch it! And it's first and ten. It's a jailbreak, and the defense jumps offside to kill the ref. Ho oh, ho! Crowd's loving it. And it's first and ten. And I've had it. I'm running out of excuses for this QB. You just, you just throw it to the guy in the and the NFL keeps pounding out the death hits on WMFL 98.8. The greatest hits of all time. Huh? Did you just say greatest hits? Where? And it's first and ten. And he's off to the races. Look at that little mutant run. Like 
a two foot putt. You miss two foot putts all the time, Grim. Straight through the uprights. Here comes the kicker. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grim? Uh, this guy in the field. Oh, I thought you were going to tell me a story like, here's the kicker. When I turned out the light, it wasn't a bra in my bed. It was a chip wearing a wig. <laughs> the burn returner was killed on that play. The coach will replace him with another player. And it's first and ten. He's leaving a wake of destruction in his path, and the body toll continues to climb. The offense is down to their last quarterback. If they lose him, they lose the game. And it's first and ten. Like he just saw 400 scary movies after that hit. Yeah, it sounds like my off season. And it's first and ten. Second down and more than the QB would like. And that's another pick. Man, oh man, the defense is going to have more receptions than the offense. He's rumbling. Boom, dead and down. He delivered the freaky fast ham sandwich with extra mustard for the death blow. Speaking of ham sandwiches, I'm going to go grab one. You want anything? No, still working on my salami here, Bricks. Thanks. That's what she said. Ah. Ah, didn't work that time. It was close, though. <laughs> Don't try to get fancy here. Just put the ball down and kick it. In that order? The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck or if that was just a one-time thing. First and ten. Hot one, hot two. I hope you covered your ears. His cleats are caked in blood and guts, and he's looking to score. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two. Almost intercepted. Second down and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot two. Ah, another interception. Oh man, he just crushed him. <laughs> I gotta see that again. I had a kid once like that walking down the sidewalk, texting with his earbuds in, freaked him out. He said, hey, what'd you do that for? I said, I did you a lesson. What lesson, he said? That unless you're a baboon with big baboon balls, you gotta pay attention. Yeah, a lot of the jungle, you know? Pow, with the brain scrambler. And it's first and 10. 
He's just starting to go somewhere, but he gets stumped after three. They usually stop me after three, too. You know, the all-you-can-eat buffets? They're not as literal as you think. Second down and seven. First and ten. Oh, and he might have just saved a touchdown on that deflection. Second down and ten. This is really a violent game, guys. Brain Washington wins by forfeit. The Cadavers will take the win any way they can get it. And killing is just as good as scoring touchdowns. There's not much left of the opposition, and the fans are loving it. There was only one way this game was going to end, and that was in a forfeit. That's not quite true, Grim. The alien spacecraft could have crashed into the stadium and ended the game. Oh, how about it? How about if you shut the hell up right now? We go down to the field and listen to what the MVP has to say. Yo, seriously, man, you think you can go toe-to-toe -to -toe with me? I will wreck your world. You understand me, Junior? I'll wreck your world. Once again, the folks at Evil SN thank our viewing audience and the Mutant Football League for allowing us to telecast this sports presentation. This is Grim Blitzrow with Brickhead Mulligan and Bricks Jr. signing off. Today's final game stats are brought to you by the Microhard Corporation. They get it right every up...